2016 is the 40th anniversary of Taipei Medical University Hospital. Our hospital has become a leading university hospital dedicated to teaching and research for improving patient care. I am proud to present our Medical Imaging Research Center, a national leader in imaging technology and the service. We are dedicated to advanced imaging research. In particular, our focus has been on anatomically based molecular imaging. Translational Imaging Research Center was founded two years ago. The goal of the center is to promote advanced clinical researchers through the bridging bench research and clinical studies. Now we have seven Tesla MR imaging labs working on animal model of human disease, three T Siemens Prisma system for advanced imaging research, neuroimaging biomarker lab for quantitative analysis, and bench for genomic and nanoparticle studies. We have two major researches. One is the radiogenomic of glioblastoma, and the other is translational study of mild traumatic brain injury. Both projects are conducted in an imaging-based approach by multidisciplinary teamworks. The key of success in imaging research is the translation between bench and clinical studies. Our translational imaging research center has clear goal and strong team. With the newly added PET MR scanner, we are looking forward to answer important clinical questions in the very near future. One of our current research interests is the radiogenomic of glioblastoma. We aim to find out the linkage between the image phenotypes and the genotypes of the tumor to assist the diagnosis of tumor and the therapy of lab. Glioblastoma is the most malignant brain tumor with a very poor survival. Due to the nature of tumor heterogeneity, its image presentation can be very complicated. We have already established the patient study as well as animal tumor model to explore the possibility to image these genotypes by clinical MR techniques. We have established several MR techniques such as the perfusion imaging, the diffusion kurtosis imaging, the MR spectroscopy, and then we can connect all these image phenotypes to the underlying genetic information. Our image lab is interested in the development of advanced MR image techniques such as diffusion ketosis imaging and the ultra short echo time imaging. Diffusion ketosis imaging measures non Gaussian water displacement, providing comprehensive information of microstructural changes as compared to diffusion tensor imaging, which is helpful in early detection of brain tumor. In addition, the check based lesion selection makes our data analysis more objective. We investigate the feasibility of using pharmacokinetic parameters derived from perfusion weighted imaging in tumor grading. We use the histogram analysis of these parameters to explore the diagnostic performance. Histogram parameters of both permeability and the blood volume show the significant differences between high and low grade gliomas and demonstrated significant correlation with genetic regulation of angiogenesis. Another research focus in our team is to identify neuroimaging biomarkers of mild traumatic brain injury, quantifying the alteration of brain connectivity and its relations with non-specific and post-concussion symptoms such as the memory deficit, depression, and sleeping disorder can benefit clinical prognosis and treatment for patients. Multiparametric MR techniques including functional MRI, tensor-based stratigraphy, susceptibility-weighted imaging, and MR spectroscopy uh, acquired from clinical patients and animal trauma models can unravel the neuropathological mechanism of this disease and provide neuroimaging evidence in assessing behavioral deficits. Our multidisciplinary team are capable to connect the functional imaging to clinical behavior and histology after brain injury, which provide a possibility to better understand this disease. We're currently carrying on an animal model mimicking etiology of mild traumatic brain injury in Taiwan and aim to characterize imaging biomarker indicating neurological sequelae and predicting long-term behavioral outcome after injury.
We developed an animal model mimicking a hit to the head during an accident. With physicians and MR physicists in our team, both clinical imaging practice and advanced imaging sequences are performed in animals. Animal research serves as a bridge between clinical and molecular studies. With more clinically relevant animal models, we attempt to investigate uh, pathological mechanisms beyond clinical imaging and further validate uh, radiological and histological correlation in this disease. We are really proud to be accredited by Joint Commission International and AHAP and enhanced with high-tech service with three Tesla MRI and upcoming Tedema. We are providing world-class patient care in the Armix era.